Hello and welcome, and today we'll be covering the history of Union Pacific 3985. I hope you like this video, and if you're not subscribed, please subscribe. Okay, let's get on with the video. Union Pacific 3985 is a 4664 Challenger steam locomotive. 3985 is one of 106 Challengers built by Alco. Background The Challenger has its beginnings to a need by Union Pacific for more powerful locomotive that could handle longer trains in the Wasatch Mountains. Working with Alco Union Pacific help which came up with the 4664 wheel arrangement. Significant help came from Union Pacific's Chief Mechanical Officer, Otto Jabelman. The 4664 proved to be an excellent combination of both speed and both power and speed. After the original 3900 proved its worth, UP purchased a total of 105 Challengers. 3985 was one of the last batch of 4664s Union Pacific acquired from Alco. 3985 would be retired in 1962. After retirement, Union Pacific would keep 3985 at the Shine Roundhouse until 1975, when it was placed outdoors next to the Cheyenne Depot. However, 3985 didn't remain there for long. In 1977, UP Auditor stored the locomotive with a condition that the work must be a volunteer effort. By, 19, by 1981, with help from several UP workers, 3985 moved again under its own power. Celebrate at UP, celebrate UP 3985's restoration. UP sent the locomotive to Rail Fair 1981 at the California State Rail Museum, along with sister engine number 844. Our 3985 didn't see as much use as a 44. In 1990, 3985 was converted from burning coal to oil. 3985 continued to run and run trains, to run excursion and business trains. Sorry about the stutter. Until 2010, when it needed a major overhaul. However, in 2012, that overhaul was canceled after. An announcement had been made that Union Pacific planned to restore Big Boy 4014 back to running condition. In January 2020, Ed Dickens, head of the UP STEAM program, announced that 3985 needed complete frame-up restoration, an investment that the railroad was not willing to make. At this time, on April 28, 2022, and an announcement was made that 3985 would be donated to the railroading heritage of Midwest America, headed by Steve Sandberg. The group plans to fully restore 3985 to running condition using the old Rock Island Shops complex that was recently acquired. Thanks for watching this short story of the history of UP 3985. Again, please like, comment, and subscribe and tell what engine you want to be covered or railroad or whatever want or whatever you want to be covered on OG Productions. Thank you for watching.